We're using the most sophisticated technology for monitoring where our white sharks are here in the White Shark Cafe. This tag is a pop-up satellite archival tag. It has a light sensor, a temperature sensor, a pressure sensor, and it has a very accurate clock. It goes on the white shark, the white shark carries the tag, and then at a point that we've programmed into the tag related to this voyage, it pops off, the float brings it to the surface, and it sends radio transmissions to Earth orbiting satellites. And we're now recovering each of these instruments as it comes up. When we get the tag back, it has second by second behavioral data and environmental data on what the white sharks do. Nice one, Meg. <laughs> It's a female, it's been on for five months, three second interval data. Wow, we got a bite on it too, look at this. The males and females are both out here. Their activities and diving patterns are, are different, very different. They almost look like different species. So the males are moving up and down in the water column. Uh, on the order of 120 times a day. Uh, the female behavior is the dial vertical migration, up to the shallow water at night, and then uh, during the day to the two to three to 400 meter range. We have two hypotheses about the, why they're here. One would be they're coming out here to feed, so there's some great food source that's out here at the cafe. The other idea is that they're coming out here to mate. These tags are helping us figure that question out. 